Hey, it's your buddy Tim Schill coming back with a new Raid Shadow Legends video. And I wanted to do a quick video just kind of based on a, a mishmash of content that I've put together over the last week or so. Uh, I built some new champions. I made some improvement on my existing champions. I got some new strategies for uh, 3x3 and regular arena. And so uh, let's just check it out. And, uh, and I'm going to show you something that one of my subscribers gave me as well. So, uh, yeah, let's do it. Okay, so to start this video, I wanted to give a big uh, shout out to She, who is a subscriber to my channel, and gifted me this account, which I thought was super cool. And uh, I gotta wonder about the uh, loyalty of the rest of you, because I'm not getting free accounts <laughs> from the rest of you. I'm just joking, obviously. Um, but uh, he was nice enough to rename it for my YouTube channel here. And um, yeah, it's. Uh, I think I'm gonna kind of use this as a free-to-play account. Um, honestly, I don't have a whole lot of time, so I'm going to kind of keep this on my phone and just kind of do it when I can. But let me show you something that I think is pretty amazing, right? Uh, she had noticed that I was uh, complaining about not having some certain champs, right? So this account is level 12. For some reason, it has nine sacred shards on it, which is amazing. But look at this. Tormen, Dracomorph. Sile the Drakes, and this guy, Noble. I don't even know who that is. As well as some other champions that I thought were pretty interesting. So I figured I would just kind of go through and uh, use this as a free-to-play and uh, test my, test my, <laughs> gosh, there are so many. Look at this. There's got to be a million, a million little, wow, that's a pretty good deal. A million little offers. Anyway, um, I'm going to keep this on my phone, use it as a free-to-play, and maybe we'll do some shard pulls. I mean, nine sacreds is pretty good for a free-to-play. So um, I'm going to go ahead and switch accounts, and uh, I'll be right back. Okay, so we're back on our main account, and we are in the midst of a Clan v. Clan, which uh, we're doing pretty well. We had a, a pretty big lead going into the night, but they had closed the gap. So I'm really just kind of hoping to get these two uh, rings. And uh, members-wise, everybody's doing pretty well. Everybody's doing pretty well. Um, we have sort of a, a minimum score we want everybody to do at like 30K or something, which isn't that hard, really. I think if you just save up, like I saved up a Great Hall upgrade, and I'm going to do that again not upgrade my Great Hall until uh, Clan v. Clan and things like that. And then, you know, wait on booking some champions and things like that. I mean, you can plan ahead for these things pretty easy. 30K is pretty easy. But um, that's going really well. And then we also have uh, the Fusion coming up, which I think everybody has seen um, in the uh, this verse, Versolf, um, which, you know, is a pretty decent HP uh, nuking-type champion. So that's kind of exciting. But I wanted to show you a couple things. The first thing I want to show you is check this out. Check this out. I got a beautiful upgrade to my Arbiter. Look at this. Bam! Quad roll on the speed. Don't quite have it, have, have it maxed out. I used my last six star uh, speed on it, but holy cow. Yeah, awesome. So my Arbiter is now running really, really fast. Let's see. I mean, not that it matters. Uh, I think she's at like 346. So yeah, I mean, for me, not bad, right? I also made some improvements to my Gurgaw, trying to get him running faster. 262 now, so in my secondary uh, three by three team, he is now um, doing really, really well. I also went through. I don't know if you guys do this, but this is sort of relaxing for me. Is I went through and and got rid of uh, all my old gear that I didn't like. Actually, I'm not quite done with it. I think I made it down to. Uh, let's see to shield set. I think after this is where I start to, and what I try to do is on this account, at least, I think I'm starting to eke out of mid game and I'm probably getting closer to end game at this point, but, but I got rid of my rare stuff because honestly, the rare stuff just doesn't give you enough stats, right? I mean, you get two free stats and then the rest you have to roll on where with the legendaries and six star epics, you get uh, a little, so you get free, three free stats on the epics and four free stats on the legendary. So 
what I did is I got rid of my I got rid of my rares and I tried to roll up at least all my epics. I, I can't afford to roll up uh, the legendaries all the way because going from 12 to 16 could cost millions of silver and, and I just don't really want to afford that. So I try to roll everything up to 12, um, at least so uh, when I use Hell Hades <laughs> artifact uh, uh, finder, it uh, it can use all the stats on the stuff. So it's, I actually find that very relaxing. I don't know if that's my OCD side coming out or what, but um, it really helps me um, feel uh, better about the account. So, so that was nice. I got that done. Um, I built out my Reho. We did a we did a, a video on that. I also built out my Raglan. I've had this champion for a bit and um, built her out. You know, I was thinking about trying to do a champion spotlight, but, I mean, there's nothing sexy about Raglan. Like, she's helpful. I did put her in, let's see, I put her in on my arena defense. So let's see, my 3x3 three three tag team. I, I changed up all my defenses, right? So what I tried to do is I tried to go two, two, um, Revive champions, and then uh, the you know the menace of any arena uh, 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 warlord, and then uh, a nuker, right? So I got that. Then I've got uh, these two, and then Gurga and Shazar is kind of my nuker and speed lead. I also wanted speed lead everywhere, right? So I put a speed lead everywhere. Then I've got uh, team two, and then team three. Um, same same idea, right? With two. Arena Nuker, she's kind of my Nuker, and then he's... Uh, so let's see how we've done. Yeah, not great. Not great. Let's see, we've won two, lost three. Who did we lose against? Okay, so this guy is, is lower than me, but he beat my two second teams. So maybe I need to get a new Warlord in there. Oh, look, he lost the first one. What did he change? Let's see. What did he change? Oh, he put an Astralon in instead of... Uh, or he put... Uh, Michalden, I see he cc'd me, cc'd me, and then he's got a he's got a blender team there. So okay, and then uh, this guy I beat, this guy lost to. He, yeah, so he outsped me here, I guess. I don't know. I, anyway, that's um that's neither here nor there. My uh my battle teams, um let's go through a couple. I'm in uh, silver three. Trying to get back to silver four. I, I took out my defense when we had that. Uh, there was some event to uh, to do uh, to progress in tag team. And so I took out my defense and went way down. And then I've been kind of trying to battle back. So it's actually fun not to have to uh, not to have to uh, go against super tough teams. So. Um, so, yeah, so I have kind of my regular squad in here. And uh, I think I'm faster than this first team, so I'm going to do that. And then I think this is a pretty good nuking team. They've got one reviver. So I think I'm going to go second my second fast team. I think my Gurgaz is going to be fast enough to freeze them before they get a chance to do anything. And then I'll go ahead and pl play my um, defense team against that. So let's see how this goes. <laughs> Hope everyone's doing well. Are y'all going to uh, go for the Fragment Summons? I think I'm going to. Every time I don't do one of these sort of free legendaries, I always regret it. So Fragment Summons are pretty easy. And so, uh, and you know, having an HP nuker, I can't seem to get a Sir Nick. So, so I feel like this is my chance to have an HP nuking champion. Oh, no, they're faster. We're in big trouble. We're in big trouble. Oh, she froze herself. Yep. We are in big trouble. Let's see if we can live through this. Ooh, ooh, leave my poor, okay, there we go. We need to take this guy out though. Okay, we got him, feared. Oh, now the bombs are coming, the bombs are coming. Say goodnight, Gracie. Say goodnight, Gracie. <laughs> Shazar is awesome, awesome. Okay, now this will be the tough one. And if this goes too long, I'll just end it, because I mean, come on. Come on. Let's see. We take out. Oh, so close. Is she going to revive? That is a tanky T. Come on, baby. Get in there. Kill her. Yep. All right. Good. We win. Okay. So, yeah. So, three by three is going well. I mean, obviously, I'm not gold. I don't. I mean, I think I'm a 
ways away from being being able to get to gold. I mean, every time I get up to high silver four or whatever, I get uh, just annihilated. So, but I'll rebuild my I think defense and and uh, I really want to 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 use the power of warlord. So I'm gonna probably put him in on a couple of more teams. But um, yeah, defense is tough, man. I mean, without being able to choose what team you're going against, right? I mean. Like I feel like I have the ultimate answer to any blender team, so let's let's look for a blender team because I just love to watch my little weeble wobble team beat all these blenders. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so here's a here's a so let's do this. We're gonna put my very very slow triple skull crown team against that. And then I'm faster than you there, and then I think I'll be faster than you here. Okay, so so we just let them kill us, and we kill them, which I love. Bring it on, suckers. One. Oh, we only got. I only got one. Uh, okay, come on, counterattack. Uh oh, she's. Uh oh. Uh oh, is she fast? Oh, she's fast enough. Okay, see how slow. <gasps> Shit, she was too slow. <laughs> she was. I talked all that smack and lost. Holy cow! All right, well, that skull crown was too slow. I don't think. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. If you're slower than this team, I mean, you're just gonna lose, right? Because he. Ooh, whoa! Who put the block debuffs up? Because he's gonna um. He is going to freeze you, and then, what are the block debuffs? Is that uh, this guy? I have one of those guys. I haven't, I've got him uh, leveled up, but I've never built him out because I just, I don't know, I don't, uh, I didn't, uh, I don't love him. So, yeah, I stole his buff. Okay, so you're done. So we win, but my, my sure thing blunder team didn't work because their skull crown was just as slow as my skull crown. So, all right, let's finish this. We'll look at uh, a couple other pieces, and then uh, we'll call it a video, kind of a midweek video. Um, and I'll wish you all luck on your uh, fragment summons. All right. So that's that. It kind of sucks that, you know, you sort of can't get your next rank until the, the upgrade. So it kind of, yeah, kind of stinks. So um, Doom Tower, still going pretty well. I got stuck. I got stuck on this guy hard for a while until I came up with this. I, I had to get rid of the speed lean and get a little more defense in, and uh, that worked pretty good. And uh, actually did better turns than Rycliffe. I know Rycliffe got a big kick out of me saying he was a better player, but uh, scoreboard there, dude. I guarantee he's going to go back and <laughs> try and beat my turn. So and that's fine. Good for him. Um, so this will be my next one, uh, Griffin and uh, – what is that? Floor 90 on hard. And then there's what? One, two. There's two more left to the top. So we're getting close. This one. I mean, come on. <laughs> what is this? Rare attack champions only. I mean, geez, Louise, give me a break. Like, here are all my rare attack champions, right? And I suppose if I spent a lot of time and effort to... Uh, to uh, redo all those, I could prop maybe get past the first wave. I don't know. I don't think I could. I don't think I could. So um, that's that. Clan boss is going well. Faction wars. Obviously, we finished our faction wars, so now I'm just farming. Um, yeah, no, things are going well. So yeah, leave me a comment. Let me know how uh, things are going for you. And uh, please, if if you're watching for the first time or if you're a regular watcher, just go ahead and, and subscribe to the channel. It would really really help me out. Would love to start uh, getting access to Polarium's test server, so I didn't wasn't constantly behind the ball on these new champions, and uh, yeah, so uh, have a great week, and uh, we'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.